Hey team, Ray here and here for Moto NZ, and another manufacturer has dropped not just hints, but the full bike. Did anyone tell Yamaha that uh, that Eichmann doesn't start for another three or four days? We've got a brand new Tenere 700, so the last one was released in 2019. That's what, going on six years now that we've had the old Tenere 700. Uh, the new one, still running that uh, 698cc CP2 parallel twin engine. However, it looks like, uh, and it's unconfirmed, but it looks like we're going to ride by wire which probably means we're getting rider modes, we're getting uh, cruise control, we've got uh, traction control in there as well. Uh, full electric for the Tenere 700, which is probably a good thing because it was kind of getting left behind. Uh, so we've got new suspension, we've got 42mm upside down, 42, 43mm upside down forks. Uh, we've got the same rear shock, but we are getting three variants. So you're getting the Tenere 700 low edition, which is going to have a seat height of 860mm uh, and a little bit less travel at 190mm uh, of travel. Uh, ground clearance is 225. Your standard version uh, is going to be around about that 875 millimeter seat height, and it's going to be 240 millimeter millimeters of ground clearance. And then we've got the rally version, which I don't have the specs on, but it's uh, it's bigger, angrier, and faster. Now we've got the same. Uh, steel tube frame. We've got the same low mounted exhaust on the right hand side. So if you drop the bike on the right hand side, you're going to bend that um, that exhaust hanger. We don't know whether it's, it's welded or bolted to the frame, but we do have a 6.3 inch color TFT display sitting in portrait orientation. So it's, uh, it's a brand new Tenere 700. Go to MotoNZ to find out more.